Uh, but I always say more carrots never hurt anybody, so that's fine. All right, so down to the mixture, guys. A quick one because we need to put this into the oven. We have a cup of oil. This is going to be the oil base of the cake. We won't use any butter, any margarine. Like, the oil will do the trick, right? And then at this point is we're going to crack in... Um, three eggs okay. three eggs are gonna go straight in there remember guys don't do what I'm doing I will crack it <laughs> aside <laughs> first uh, crack it aside and then uh, dump that in there right all right and then our last egg is gonna go in there as well just to make sure that we have the enough volume when it comes to the egg mm. and then what we have here is some sugar i'm going to put a half cup of sugar remember the carrots do add the sweetness okay. so you don't need too much sugar that's just regular brown sugar and we're going to give this a mix like literally the oil the eggs um are what create that the liquid aspect and also the fat is in there mm. and once you mix it you notice that the eggs and the and the oil tend to mix so perfectly mm. it forms like a very thick Bona low to me mixer. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> just feel <laughs> like, yeah, I feel like this one, you don't need to over um, mix okay. uh, cake batter. So this will work just perfectly. Yeah, I was just about to spill all that on me. All right, so what I have here, guys, are some of my favorite spices when I'm making cakes. It goes perfectly. Of course, some cinnamon, as you can see, we've got cinnamon here, mixed spice, some nutmeg, and some cardamom. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to put more of cinnamon, so I'm going to put two teaspoons of cinnamon straight in there oh yes i love that sound <laughs> straight in there the mixed uh, spices straight in there as well all of that goodness straight in there and then a bit of the cardamom just not too much and then we're going to take this uh, nutmeg and remember nutmeg is very very strong so you don't want to use a lot of it because this is a whole nutmeg and i'm just going to grate some of it in there just to have those lovely pieces. Remember, it's very pungent, very strong. It can dominate, oh my gosh, it can dominate the whole cake. So you just wanna put a little bit of it. Mm. And at this point is where you come here with your, um, with your carrots, remember? I wanted to make sure that the carrots soak in that all the liquid. So you wanna come in with the carrots and then just give that a gentle mix. Now, at this point, if you have some raisins, if you have some pecans, um, nuts, you can just dump them in there. They go perfectly in this batter. As you can see, it's already such a thick, wonderful, I love the color of this. It's beautiful. Now, at this point, after that, is gently just, this is sifted flour. I'm gonna add just a bit of it first. That, this is a cup of it. So just a bit of it, just to make sure that we get that incorporated in there completely, okay. right? And then I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest of it. Rest of it as, as, as I, I finish it off by putting it into our tray.